like this carpet up. I did it in this corner just to see if it was easy as I've seen in multiple videos, but it actually is. So what it is is a nail piece of wood nails up, and this is a uh, push down in those areas. And all you're doing from the corner is pulling it up like that. Pulling it back. And I've seen on a couple other videos, you can make a cut like that and pull back like that too. But what we're going to do is pull back and fold what we can, cut it and fold what we can, and roll what we can, same with the pattern. Same with the pattern as you can see. Just pull back. It's kind of flimsy though, so it's easier. It's uh glue down on this side. I ain't really too much worried about it. I get a scraper and get that up. You can see here. The uh, cut here. And then just roll to that cut. Fold it over and then get that underlayment. Do the same thing and keep doing it all the way. Yeah, it's cool. Showing on the app. And, uh, taking all this, I'm not trusting the towel anymore. Keeping this towel. We haven't even set up the house because we're going to change a lot of stuff. So, the floor is one of the major factors once we get this part of the floor in. We even push everything that way, but definitely getting into it. Okay. Like I said, I don't have a um, hammer, so it's a little tougher. Sorry for the shakiness. You can see that's how I'm doing it with my hand. Like such. Popping right up like it should. Only thing about it is they put nails right into the concrete, which is not ideal. But they did it. So, just gonna continue to pull that up all the way around. Tomorrow, maybe. Might get these baseboards off. Definitely doing the clean up tonight. All the excess around the trim, and then uh, take these tax strips, break them up, and put it in the bag. So get ready to toss it. All of this been cut already. Continue to push. Excuse my daughter's room. Still unpacking. She's done. She said she didn't want to stay down there anymore. She want to watch videos on the phone. Why you come up here with these shoes? You know you heard me calling you. She's ignoring me right now. Hey! You hear me? Oh, okay. Okay, guys. So, we're done pulling the carpet up. Didn't take us long at all. And now we have to pull this brown stuff up i think he said it was called underlayment something and then my husband has to pull this brown strip up how are you gonna put a tv in the office area it's to work He can't really watch this huge TV here. From up here. Whatever sitting on top of here Yeah, no, that's not He always has to overdo it. But catch you guys in a minute. We're almost done. Yay! It's almost time to go get the hardwood floor. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. 
we'll give an update later. Bye. Hey, it's going down at the new Chevy shop. Getting uh ready for this wood flow. Can't do the carpenter tile, kind of ugly. They really like it, man. I could do it all. Somebody give me a job, man, before it's too late. They, they gonna be mad when it's too late, though, but hey, doing my thing. Y'all see it. I'm out, though. About to go ahead and keep doing this. It'd be fine. It's entirely up to you. I mean, we'll have to pay for it to sign before you take it. Because honestly, um, we have a store. She can't make up her mind again. Why is she on the floor? Get up. This isn't laminate. This is vinyl or whatever it's called. I just want the floor. No, it's you just want a floor, but you was just saying you stressed that you didn't. Finally got a floor, man. Came to a conclusion. Uh, waiting on the guy. Waiting on the guy. Come around with the uh, forklift. Loading it all into the Malibu. Hopefully it goes well. About a thousand pounds of wood. A little bit less. But everything will go well. God is watching me. I'm gonna load this thing up, get back to the house, and uh, start dropping it out on, on the floor. Dropping it off on the floor. The floor didn't fit. It's too long. So I'm driving back 45 minutes to pick up the thing and drive it back 45 minutes. Yes, yes. Glad the, glad the van got. I mean, uh, fuel already, so we don't gotta make no stop. Just go get the van and head back. We gotta sit in the house for two days anyway, so uh, we'll just go with that. If I don't pick it up today, ain't no telling when I'm pick it up. It'll probably be next weekend. But I have to get it today or tomorrow to me, for me. Head back. Oh, you can you can drop the whole pallet if you want. I can't do that. You don't get the whole pallet. Okay. It'll take about half. So we all getting the floor. It's all nice looking, different patterns and stuff. Very very nice looking. Started pulling baseboard trim off. Uh, trying to keep the uh, paper on the uh, drywall from peeling off like this. But it's going to happen in some spots. I prevented it down there. Going to do a cleanup, get the rest of this tile out, and we'll be ready to roll once these uh, floor get its acclimation period. But I'm going to mark everything and move it so. I can uh, know exactly where it go. Um, I'm gonna start one of them corners over there and move this way with everything. Well, glad we got all our stuff upstairs. Um, the flooring is next to come. I'm gonna start doing some painting tonight and marking all this baseboard trim, get this towel. Uh, off the um, ground, get this towel. So, so tonight we're gonna do some painting and um, get this baseboard stuff situated and all the towel off the ground, and we'll be able to 
make some moves after that.